Order. And now I give the floor to Ms. Karen Smith, Alliance of NGOs on Crime Prevention and Criminal Justice. Mr. Chairman, distinguished delegates and colleagues, we're definitely honored to contribute here today to this effort to construct solutions together. I echo the, many of the words of my colleagues, uh, and for the Alliance's full statement, you can find that on cbcjalliance.org. Now to the to the core points, keeping it short. Here we stress that a strong UN program on drugs and crime enables the maximum contribution needed to meet the Millennium Development Goals. And Mr. Chairman, we believe that no member of the international community can speak of any crime without acknowledging its victims and their rights, particularly in the context of promoting sustainable development. Therefore, we call on all states to adopt and implement appropriate legislation, policies and practices for giving victims a voice, for protecting and assisting them. And specifically, we call for the establishment of an expert group combined of governments, UN, expert NGOs and victims to study specific implementation strategies to combat crime and ensure sustainable development and to make recommendation, recommendations for relevant mechanisms in the implementation, implementation of, for example, the UN Convention Against Transnational Organized Crime and its protocols without delay. Further, we encourage UNODC and other UN agencies present, of course, to take greater advantage of the expertise and implementing capabilities available among N NGOs. Specifically, we urge greater involvement of NGOs in the country review mechanisms of the UN Treaty, Treaties Against Transnational Organized Crime and Against Corruption. As civil society organizations, we look forward to maintaining our vital partnership in advancing the effectiveness of crime prevention and criminal justice because together we will more effectively be able to promote a culture of integrity, accountability, transparency and sustainability. I thank you very much for your kind attention. I thank you, Ms. Smith, for your statement.